Yes, yes, here with whiskey. Mm -hmm. Yeah, star boy, wonder. Mm -hmm. Big whiskey, big whiskey. Big whiskey. Yeah. Big whiskey. Yeah. Bachelor don't want any casting at all. You see, even whiskey, they look for a perfect picture. Before you see any Instagram picture out there that's so so beautiful, so so beautiful and perfect, you should register in the back of your mind that hmm, that person must have taken hundreds of pictures. Then you have to pick one from those hundreds of pictures. There is nothing perfect in this world. If you apply that to everything you are doing in this life, you will succeed. If you know for a fact that there is no perfect thing that you have to try and try and try and try again. Before my, me, even me myself, I will look for the perfect angle, set my camera well in order to get the perfect video that is suitable before posting it. Nobody wants to cast himself there. So you you will take picture once you do the best. Oh, I'm not photogenic. You take pictures another time, you do the best. Oh, it's relax. There is no perfect picture. There is no perfect picture. Just take the one you can take and pick from it. Those magazines, they take thousands of pictures. They will just pick only five from those thousands of pictures they have taken. And let's say they be. So can someone try to explain something to me? Try to make excuse for whiskey. Whiskey decided to go to his neighborhood yesterday. Suru, Mary, good and fine. The guy share money. He would donate a hundred million naira to the kids over there for Christmas, which I honestly have my own thoughts about that too. And him spray money in the street. I also have my own thoughts about that. So, first, let me just drop that. I'll see if we visit that aspect. Now, the guy go hang out with MC Oluwomo. And you know very well who MC Oluwomo be. And you know the kind of reputation MC Oluwomo gets towards Nigeria youth. During the last election, you know, eh, this is what I always say. Nigeria simply easily forgets. All those celebrities, be it David o, be it Whiskey, Dona Machala, or you guys like him, or see him now hanging out with him, so no one more. The people, I don't want to directly accuse them, the people, you guys know their reputation, you know what they did. But all because of, say, okay, now that's that click of, uh, of uh, rich men, click of, uh, uh, they know each other, you know, they're into they're the same rich guys in Lagos. So he had to go visit him. I'm not saying it's wrong, though, but all the same. The same way with a blast person like Bonaboy. If Bonaboy, they fight for... Bonaboy is just someone who we uh, talk about injustice. In Nigeria, meanwhile, is castigating Nigeria. It says that for big artists abroad. We can also use the same energy towards whiskey as well. You come outside during answers, you talk, 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 talk. And meanwhile, you now go go to kiss, kiss the hands of these guys. I go to kiss the hands of these guys. Okay. Wow. Well, uh, 100 million naira make it donate. I hope it goes really, really far. After all, me, I don't get any money to donate. So I hope he goes really, really far. And according to Daniel Reda, he said, Whiskey promised to build schools across Africa. And also, Whiskey now is donating 100 million naira for kids in his whole neighborhood for Christmas. That if Whiskey will channel that money into building schools and providing free education, that's going to create better impact than just using that money to buy food and buy clothes for people, for kids, for Christmas. You know, whiskey has every entitlement towards his money, or now he's going to use his money. He doesn't owe anybody that, uh, that uh, ability to dictate for him. I want to use the money. That one, well registered. But at the same time, what did Danny Rega talk is kind of like, it makes sense. Because we in Nigeria, I've said it yesterday, we so much depend on food 
you so much depend on food. The only thing we want, we, we just want to chop and forget. Chop and forget the next sorrow. And it's not good. Whiskey big up. The only reserve I have about whiskey is the same PCT and so on. No one. Although it's not the we we shouldn't be expecting whiskey to be a freedom fighter or fight for Nigerian freedom. And even Nigerians have, are not even ready. But that aside, then when it comes to someone said, if David Doe was the one doing what whiskey was doing yesterday, they would say David Doe is looking for media relevance. Is clown chasing, but now it's whiskey. Whiskey is not doing that. Whiskey is a is someone who everybody is, is, is being praised. You know, if person don't do, they do good too much. Eh? People do not really appreciate the goodness even because they know it's a regular customer in doing good. Whiskey has never done that before. That is why it becomes a really really huge news. David Doe is a he, he is someone who is known constantly for going into his neighborhood, you know, giving out constantly, sharing money constantly. So whiskey they do it all secretly. Let me say yes. I shouldn't use the the I shouldn't use the term that whiskey has not been doing. Whiskey has been doing it so secretly, but this is the first time actually going out into his wood to show love. Which I commend. It's really, really nice. Well, let's move past that. Let's talk about Bonner Boy concert in Germany. The other day, you guys said Bonner Boy was flop. Couldn't, couldn't sell out a show in the USA. Two shows. One in the 18,000 capacity, Bonner Boy was able to sell out like a, a five or 6,000 tickets in 18,000 capacity. Then the other one was slightly above, uh, close to 15,000 capacity, and Bonner Boy was able to sell out. Only 5,000 something capacity. That show was flop. Uh, you guys bucked in. But now, come in Berlin, Germany. Hmm? Bono Boy completely sold out 20,000 capacity. The moral of this lesson is that, see, no be every day, Pesigudi win. Every day is not Christmas. They are kind of like set back. Set back in a way that, oh, you might not be able to do this this year, but that doesn't mean you won't be able to do another venue that the same year. So you understand? Uh, Bono Boy who sold that 60,000 capacity in the UK couldn't sell out two venues in the USA. And I applaud him for that because it's a win win to all Afrobeat artists. Bono Boy performing, showing himself. He knew very well that all those shows no sell out. He could have easily said, oh, you know what, I am sick. I cannot come for that show due to some serious so, so, so and so, I cannot come to that show. Then you guys will not know about him not selling out that show. He will just go firm. Then he will fix another date. Then he will sell another ticket to make up. But no, he decided to still go to show himself. I think... At least that little consideration should be applauded. That little consideration should be applauded because it's a win to all Afrobeat artists. Maybe that uh, that city were not that familiar with Afrobeat songs. They're not that familiar with Afrobeat artists. But Bonner Boy just paved the way now. Bonner Boy just paved the way to, for all the Afrobeat artists to go perform in that city. No, introducing Afrobeat song. This is exactly what those old artists that are two phase, the band, all those old artists, uh, Tony Tetula, them, and all those. This is the kind of uh, of sacrifices they made. They were making so much, but they were still going into penetrating into this market, trying to perform. Trying to perform. And this is exactly what the Bank of W. Even whiskey that's at them, David do as at them, they're trying to pave. And I'm happy that some of them are even enjoying the benefit now. Someone like whiskey who have been there and David do that. They keep enjoying the benefit of what they participated in working on. Well, guys, so let me know exactly how you feel about that. Yeah, and in fact, if you check uh, Twitter correctly, and so no more whiskey trending. 
and so no one more at whiskey. People were quite surprised that whiskey visited so no one more. <laughs> uh people were quite uh, quite surprised why are you surprised eh? why are you surprised don't be surprised that politics politics you may you get carried sorry for you you should do all those things 